The liars of a force will walk into someone's home and look it over without consent. I am quite confident that when I lived in my townhouse, a police officer who I wanted to talk to about the constant hacking on my cell phone that was going on, walked into my home when I wasn't home. Because I found things rearranged and I found things missing. And when I got back to the Carmel Police Department to try to talk to him about what was going on my phone, they acted like they didn't know anything about it. You see, liars in the force have all kinds of technology that needs to be shared about by somebody like Evie Pompouris or someone who's got that kind of clout to explain people the transparency of what they need to know and what they need to see. The problem we have today is that we have foreign students here that don't give a shit about you or me. And they will play in our content. They will get on our phones. They will steal our batteries. They will ruin things. And that has happened to me. I've had phones destroyed by people on campus. Really, them putting their hands in my pockets and taking it out, and I'm pretty sure it was a law enforcement officer. I'm also pretty sure it was a black man who was a maintenance man, who was always trying to play me with, what did I have, what can he have, off the poles that I found. I didn't mind that, but he was always somebody who wanted to underpay me for the things I found. Sometimes I just give shit to him, and sometimes you offer stuff to them, and they'll say, no, no, I don't want it. And then you find it missing later. Someone has definitely pulled the battery out of my phone, t changed out the back of my phone, made it so I can't get into my phone. And openly, I could see the reconstructions in my phone when I was traveling by the police officers and the liars of America. I hate the force. I want them defunded immediately. I believe the president or the vice president might be thinking about that. And so every time one of those officers pulls a shit game against the United States Constitution, against the federal laws that protect every human being in America, they screw themselves out of their pensions.